thank you for joining me tonight, and welcome to the New Year edition of Beards Without Borders. Happy 2017. Welcome to Beards Without Borders. Tonight is the night that we talk about the foundation for the future, so that when we get to 2018, we look back on 2017 and we say, yes, it was a very good year. Cigar tonight is a Cuba Deluxe from Acid Cigars, a gift from Tim Trimble of the Rooster Run Workshop in Delaware. Makes cigar box guitars. You need to check them out. Google him. Tim Trimble Rooster Run Workshop. This was a gift. El Dorado, my favorite rum. Perfect with a cigar. This is to you. Cheers. Oh, it's magnificent. Buttery. A little hint of molasses in there. Notes of vanilla and spice. Mm. Reminds me of a butter rum lifesaver and caramelized brown sugar mixed with butter and poured over popcorn. Caramel popcorn. One of my favorite things to make. Mm. I would never mix this. This is a sipping rum. I love it. You should try it. Cigar and a little sipping. Always good for the soul. <coughs> Excuse me. Got the small oil lamp tonight. This is the one you see in the morning videos. And of course the hanging one. The prospector's oil lamp. Rather than looking on at 2016 as a year of regrets, what did you do to move forward? And it doesn't matter where you are. You could be living in a cinder block building. I know I have people living in RVs and trailers watching this. Tents, yurts, tree houses, tiny houses, high rises, mansions, farms, deserts, jungles. My fan base is from all over the world, and I appreciate you. It is a two-way street. As much as you have expressed that you enjoy these broadcasts and some of the content that I bring forth, I appreciate you as well. hear that jet overhead? Beards Without Borders started 
I forget what month last year was the first time I did it, when I realized that there were watchers all over the world who wear different clothes, who eat different foods, who have different religious traditions, who have different cultural traditions, who have dark hair, light hair, no hair, short beards, long beards, people who've been incarcerated, people who've been depressed, suicidal, people who've had extreme success, people that have, have had success and then lost everything, and then people who've never had anything are all watchers of this channel. I read every email, every question, every comment. It seems like I have a an ongoing 600 emails that I have to plow through. Sometimes I'll take one of the days that I don't cut hair and I'll knock off about 200 of those. And then within a few days, another 200. So it seems like I'm always running at about 600. Nothing like a cigar and distilled spirits. Sipping. We're not sipping to alter our reality. We're appreciating the taste. A woman that I used to date used to say to me, every time we go out to eat your first bite or first drink, you always close your eyes like you're thinking. I said, I am. I'm trying to taste. And I'm letting the vapors come up through my nostrils. And I'm getting the, the vapors. It's a different note when you smell the spirits than when you taste them. Mm, it's so good. We've tried a lot of different things in 2016. We did the morning broadcasts, which I really like doing. It's a quiet time. The Rise and Shines have been very fun. I enjoy those. And this time of day, or night I should say, I don't have the energy to be yelling rise and shine mothers and brothers, cheese wedges and handlebars all over the world. I don't have that kind of energy. I'm a morning person. I like having my coffee in the morning, sometimes a pipe. This is the year I'll probably pick up my guitar again. This is the year I'll pick up my painting again. I feel my creativity coming back. If things are stifled in your life, it's like a storm. Wait for the clouds to pass and the sun is there. It's always there. You know, the sun never goes away. It's just behind the clouds. And many times your troubles and concerns and worries are nothing but clouds, and they will pass. And the sun will beam down on you. You can't hurry a cigar, can you? You take your time with it. You think. You watch the smoke disappear. A lot of times I look at my worries like the smoke. They just disappear. It's been said that depression is focusing and obsessing on the past. And anxiety is focusing and obsessing on the future. 
But when you have a cigar and spirits, and for those that don't drink, it could be a glass of juice, a glass of water, a cup of coffee, hot chocolate, whatever. You end up living in the moment. And you slow down. It's not about a nicotine fix. It's not about altering your mindset through alcohol. It's about living now and being thankful for what you have in the small surrounding that you have. So even if you're watching this on a mobile device or a computer, a laptop, or on a big screen TV, that's your own little little paradise, your own little world of peace. How will 2017 be different? Have you made mistakes in 2016? Do you have regrets? You know, a man's face changes when he talks about his regrets. And it's not so much about the things that he did, it's about the things that he didn't do. The chances he didn't take the risks he didn't take, the love he didn't share, the text he didn't send, the letter he didn't send. This year, I'm going to get me a fountain pen or a quill of some type, and I'm going to start writing letters to people. And it's probably going to be on parchment And I'm probably going to seal, the, fold them up and seal them with wax and send them out. Letters of appreciation to people. That's what I'm doing in 2017. What will you do that's going to be different, that's going to show people that you appreciate them? In 2017, I'm going to be interviewing people, talking with people. It won't be just me talking. There's going to be some episodes where I'm chatting with somebody. We started some rock and roll sessions. If you watch me on Instagram Live, I do Rock and Roll Tuesdays. That's been fun, doing live broadcasts and doing the Instagram live broadcasts every night. I called that Beard Nuts. Get up in the morning, I challenge you. Light a candle. Get yourself a small oil lamp. Okay? Get yourself a small oil lamp or a candle. Have your cup of coffee or tea. Sit at your table. If you want to fire up a pipe, if you smoke in the house, that's fine. If not, that's okay. And write and think and read. Morning is the best time of day. Years ago, I started getting up when I woke up excuse me, woke up in the morning. I wake up naturally at about 4.30 in the morning. Probably that's more because of my uh, bladder than anything else. But I found that when I try to go back to bed, I just lay there. So years ago, I just learned, get up. Just get up. And I have a great day. That way I have a couple hours in the morning before anyone else gets up. It's peaceful. It's quiet. I get to think about my day, I look at my notes, 
I look at my goals. Goals are like a rudder on a ship. They're like a GPS. Without your goals and intentions, you just kind of wander. Well, this has been fun. I appreciate the time you spend with me in the Van Gogh room. It's a humble room. It's not outside. In the summertime, I do these, obviously, outside. I appreciate you spending time with me in my little humble Van Gogh room with my Van Gogh prints on the wall, my distilled spirits, my cigars and pipes, and just talking, keeping you company, and you're keeping me company too. I appreciate that. So let's make 2017 a great year. I'm excited about it. I'm very optimistic. Good things are around the corner for you. You know that, right? I don't care where you are, where you've been. The good life is ahead of you. If you can squeeze out a few peaceful moments, because Beards Without Borders is about peace. If you can squeeze out a few peaceful moments every day, it's enough to get you through the whole day, no matter how hard your work is. Thank you for joining me. I just want to give you one last salute. Here's to you. And I will see you again on another episode of Beards Without Borders. Thank you for joining. Peace be with you.